computer scans it using your yes. webcam or using your iOS webcam or phone. iOS phone or whatever. It's only on it's on iPad. It's not on okay. it's not on phone. So you snap a picture with that or it accesses it. It, it. it accesses it. In fact, it like it updates it with new information the when you AR do that. Style? Yeah, AR style. It actually looks kind of cool. Where it's okay. just like you can see. Oh, he edited this whole chapter, like this whole shit. He cut it out and he wrote a little note about why he cut it out. Wait, wait so it, what are you actually taking a picture of? The stuff in the book. In so the there is actually book. a physical. There's book. a physical yeah. book, and that. So this is like Carmen San Diego style. You have a photo guide that you are looking through to get through to the solutions of these things. Yes. And gra- but it's a little more open-ended it's than that. It's a lot more but open-ended yes, than but that. It's the, it's, there is a damn book. There is a Can real I take book. a break here for a second? Yes, I have to, It's killing me because we we recorded this podcast and we had uh, of just a fantastic... Just, I don't even want to think about just it. Carmen, I'm actually kind of mad you're bringing it up because just a, we're just going to make other people mad by even saying just it. Just a great Carmen Sandiego storyline because uh, this is the second time Carmen Sandiego is coming up. It's Carmen Sandiego and she had her... Was a twin yeah, sister, twin sister. Who, Common Law, who is from who is from L.A. Carmen, LA. it was Carmen L.A. Yeah, and pronounced Carmen Law, pronounced, but, but the police, the, everybody calls it her Common Law because she's a cop, and what she does is hunt down Carmen San Diego. I forgot that she was a cop. She's yeah. a cop, and she's and the police chief is like, "You're off the case," and she's like, "I have to find Carmen San Diego because she's fucking dumb because she just steals dumb shit." I, the Louvre is pretty cool. You yeah, but where you, are you going to even put that? But she, you can't steal the Louvre. What are you going to do with the Nile River? You where are you going to put that? You can't steal the Nile River. And you can't just steal the Nile River. And Nile, you can't <laughs> Nile steal the liver. Nile's liver. And Nile's then re- crane? What? Re- re- replace <laughs> the Nile's liver with a fucking spaghetti, plate of spaghetti and meatballs and be like, oh, she's in, she's in Italy. Like so, so call- she just wants them to give. She just wants to give people a shot. She wants to be fair. Why would you do? Why are you car- Why are you going and stealing the Leaning Tower of Pisa and then like have a pocket full of baguettes? Why would you do that? I think it might be more of a compulsion. Like she doesn't actually need right. these things. Is she leaving them behind, or are they like? Oh, no, I, I think she's she fa- limited inventory space. It's an encumbrance mechanic, and she's like, like I got to drop something. I guess I'll drop these. I'm baguettes. going back to France anyway. I can get more baguettes when I'm back in France. I'll just I drop guess, these uh, here. I guess I, what all I have are these berets. Yeah, it's I, all bid, I did France already. I'm not going back there. I'll just dump these berets, <laughs> and then you, intrepid, uh, intrepid detective, are like berets. Well, those can only come from one stereotypical place. The Green Berets. The Green Berets. She must be, they must be, this goes all the way to the top. Right. I'm going to throw out this Fodor's uh, guide, and I'm going to go on the internet and go find out why uh, chemtrails are happening. Yeah, why? Because Carmen Sandiego. And Common Law uh, kills Carmen Sandiego. You also described Common Law as having a gun and a sword. She's got one gun because, uh, she got one gun with the, just one bullet that says, uh, it's got the, the initials C. SD on it, and that's for Carmen San Diego. This, it's not it doesn't work though, because San Diego is one word. Okay, so she's got a couple bullets. She's got one that says CSD, and she's got one that just says CS, and she's got one that Computer says uh, C Dizzy on it, just in, just in case she runs into somebody else. Okay, uh, and there's made of, one's made of silver for werewolves because she's because she's, Carmen San Diego is also a werewolf. <gasps> yeah, Wait, I, is is Common Law a vampire? No. Okay, this is vampire hunter. So one's actually made of garlic, one's made of silver, and one's made of uh, bronze. What what gets killed from bronze? Mermen. Does do they? They do now. Okay. And one's made of one's made of croissants. That's not a metal. Croissant, croissant is not a metal. Bullets. It's impossible. Because she wants to be she actually secretly wants to be like Carmen San Diego and leave croissants all over the this world. This is a new development. This was not no, I mean, up this yesterday. most of this is new, this actually. Is expanded universe. Yeah. Anyway, they meet and then they the cause Carmen Carmen San Diego has one last heist, the most impossible heist of all. What she want to heist? She wants to steal Alex's. Was it Alex's hope? Can't steal what's not there. So she goes inside Alex, and then Alex, what happens? Oh, I don't even remember this. Part. She gets trapped inside, inside a inside the empty the empty space. Soul of Alex. Oh, that's right. Yes, she got into the big white room, and the, there was like a phone there, and she, you know it was just ringing, and then she picks it up, and then the door slams shut behind her. And it's just all you hear before the line clicks off was, gotcha. Yeah. And she's trapped inside. And then someone's dad got in we, there, too. The, I don't we'll remember. get to the dads okay. later. Dads aren't here yet. Dad, right. Dads were from... Anyway, Ice that's, a, is really that's cool. a recap of the... Yes. That's pretty much the most important stuff you missed from that other recording. Yeah, basically. I'm glad we recapped it. Yeah. Common Law versus Carmen Sandiego. That pretty good. Uh, uh, you can look for that in my novel uh, called Carmen Breaker. Carmen Breakers? Mm-hmm. That sounds like a that Carm- sounds like a the next epic game. Carmen, yeah, I'll work on that. So, how do you win? 
so you like progress from chapter to chapter, right? Like, and it, it does some cool stuff where where. Let's move on to uh, other publishers One, yeah. who can who maybe will take their floor space. New publisher, new maybe challenger enters year. the game. GameStop. Question mark. Question mark. Why are we saying game? Well, All okay, right, two stories yeah, in one. Yeah, two in one. Hey. Somniac's got a new hot game. Oh, yeah? What's that about? It's uh, We're going to dive deep into Insomniac's new game, Deep Dreams. Nope. Dive Dreams. Not Diving into my dreams. Still wrong. Dive. Wait, no, I got it. It's a uh, deep dive. No. Dive deep. Deep down? Deep. N- no. Deep, he's, deep he's, up. The deep below. The deep. No. Is it dream? Deep in, impact. Is it dream in the There's title? No dream, dream. Is hope in the title? No. You're t- okay, I'll get you there. Ready? Okay. Yeah. What's the most racist movie you can think of? Uh, Birth of a Nation. Uh, okay, what's the what's the most racist Disney movie you can think of? Song of the South. Little Mermaid. Yep, Little Mermaid's oh. coming. <laughs> okay, the deep deep down in the Little Mermaid. <laughs> Song of the Deep. Okay. Song of the Deep. South. Okay. Song of the Deep South. Not the deepest, the south. darkest South. <laughs> Song of the Deep South, boy. Yeah, that antediluvian South. Yeah. <laughs> we think it's time. We think the culture's really changed. It's really ready. <laughs> it's really, uh, we got. We it's can tie sequel. this into infinity. Yeah. We can really make some really good uh, hot toys to life on this one. Fuck. <laughs> Someone get Johnny V on the line. Song, Song of the, the South deep toys. South. We go this time. We go even deeper. We go even deeper. We go even. <laughs> Let, when let me tell you about the songs. The songs are very good. They're catchy. It's a lot of hand clapping. Yeah. It's real, real good. It's real one of those songs where you sing it, and then halfway through you realize what you just said. <laughs> I've, I've never seen Song of the South, but I've seen the Song of the South parody in Fletch Lives hundreds of times. Okay. That's 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 cool. my, my entire experience with that. It's the thing. Yep. You know what I love from Disney? What's that? What was the bear who had to pick up the trash? You put it in a dun 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 dun. No idea. You put it. In, Did you just make that up? You put it in the back. Dun, 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 doing the Humphrey Hump. That's, oh, tra- no. Trash Bear. Trash Bear. You remember Trash Bear? I do remember Trash Bear. Doing no, hum- I don't. The Humphrey no, I don't. Hump. It's the not Humphrey the Hump. Humphrey Hump. The Humphrey Hump. It's <laughs> not a thing. It's doing the Humphrey Hump. I think you think of the Humpty Hump. <laughs> and then <laughs> you put it in a, doing the Humphrey Hump. Humphrey Hump. I'm going to look this up right no. now. No. Humphrey Hump Disney. Oh He's been getting busy in a Space Mountain bathroom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So GameStop. GameStop. All right. So How are they connected to Song of the Deep? It is called Song of the Deep. There is a girl. She has a dad. Her dad oh, goes missing deep in the water. He's in the ocean. Why'd you put your dad in the ocean? I, I don't, don't know, know. But they got to go find the him. submarine. Oh, it's a sort of like Blaster Master. You get out of the submarine. You can shoot boom, boom. And then also like oh, her dad. And then GameStop says, we'll publish that. Oh, wait. Back up a second. Insomniac, uh, well, this game also digital, uh, the digital, digital, and then ins- and then and then GameStop is like, well, you want to sell that thing physically? We got some, we got some space. On I'm the a shelves. physical store. I'm a I physical. Got, we got a lot of space these days. We got some fucking rock band drums you know, up there at this point. Shove those rock band drums <laughs> out. So put then, up song of the deep. So what's GameStop's official word on this uh, collabo? <laughs> They're saying like we're not an official tr- publisher. We're not. We don't like to use the word publisher. D- nobody. But. Yeah, so it's a little, it's weird. Yeah. I'm just, I can't help but think about the scenario where, like, the customer comes into the store. Uh-huh. And is like, hey, like, I'm just, I, I don't know what to get my kid for Christmas. Oh, well, you should, you should, I got an idea for you. I got an idea for you. You want to, <laughs> welcome to the store. I've been out of work for a long time. Thanks for coming in. Uh, what do you want to buy your kid for this Christmas? Hey, he's, I, he likes a bunch of different games, like shooters. Shooters, or? like shooting, like shooting, like shooting all kinds of things, like shooting water, like that Mario water kind of game. You don't no, want to buy no, that? No, no, no. He likes to shoot like Nazis and aliens and things like that. You know what everything has in common? You said Nazis and aliens. You know what they all have in common? H2O. H2O, that's water. You know what water is? You, know, you understand what water is. Yeah, like, I, 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 some water. You want some water right now? I would love, I would be, I would love a drink. Okay, so you love water. That was established that you love water. Your I, kids probably I love do. water too because you're a good parent. Yeah, I'm a I'm Yeah, a and you teach kid well. Like, love water. So love anyway, water. let's go deep down in the water. Let's go with Song of the Deep. You like songs? You like singing? I uh, you, know, you like musicals? I, I know. I'm not a big fan of You like hip hop? We don't like to keep it in the house. Okay, you like pop music? Love pop music. Okay, you like that uh, Taylor Swift? Oh, that Taylor Swift. You know what Taylor she Swift really loves? She loves music. She loves songs. Mm-hmm. You know what songs are? Songs are deep. Songs will move your body. Songs are deep in the water. You like deep in the water? So Song, song of the Deep is a new game you should go buy. Oh, how much is it? It's uh, it's free. It's, it's zero money down if you join our fifteen dollar club right now. Well, I don't think it's the only game. I I'm, I don't really have any use for. And a it's club. fifteen dollars. Okay, that sounds. And you get the club for free. 
Okay. Well, okay. What is there anything else I should do? I need anything else? For yeah, this? you'll need this. Uh, you'll need this song on the deep. Not called an amiibo. It's called a. It's called an ami friend. It's you need this ami friend that you put on the. Is it French? Like a me? Like like mon ami? You know how? Yes. Is your friend is his friend is a mon ami uh, mon ami Bo. It's Bo. He's from Song of the South, but he's now he's now back in Song of the Deep. Wait a second. Is this connected to Song of the South? Not at all. Do you want it to we- be? Well, you know, a lot of people don't like that movie. Yeah, that is definitely not connected but to our family. Loved it. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it is tangentially connected in your mind. You can buy Song of the Deep. I don't know. Here's the thing. My son said he really just wants to play the new Call of Duty. So I- we don't stock that anymore. That's for trash. That's for bad, bad for bad people. Listen, to, look, I brought. Are you calling my son a bad person? Yeah, no. Listen to this. I brought a clip from the YouTube celebrity garbage man. <laughs> internet garbage. <laughs> I'm internet garbage man, and I love Call of Duty because I'm into internet garbage. You see that? I don't want my son to go to be like internet garbage man. <laughs> Certainly do not. So you walk in the store. What'd you see? Uh, Ross Perot was behind the counter, and <laughs> what, I, it's a face uh, I can trust. Yeah, that's a face you can trust. What else did you see? Brandon for what? What game? I saw Song of the Deep. That's was, right. It's the hottest game this year. Is that is that the, those posters are there because people love this game? <laughs> they love this game. They are way into Song of the Deep. Everybody loves it. Look at this. Five stars. Ross Perot. Where? What publication gave it five stars? Uh, RP Magazine. Okay. No, not R- Game Informer though. <laughs> nope. It's Rock Paper. It's Rock Paper Perot. It's RPP. Gamer. RPPG. Ross Perot's Paper game. <laughs> Give five stars. It's a great game. Buy it. You don't want a strategy guide, though. Because you want to get as deep as you want to get as deep as possible. Did you pre-order? I, we didn't know it was coming out. I love you. I'll cut you a deal. Uh-huh. Fifteen dollars. That sounds that sounds okay. it's flat rate. Oh, it's a flat rate. So it's the same for me as it is for you. <laughs> yeah, that's flat rate. All right. Listen, you can ship this game wherever you want. Free. Is there any way? So I, I see that you have these boxes here, but inside there's just a code? That's a code for happiness. You like fortune cookies? You ever, you ever eat Chinese food? Uh, yeah, I love Chinese food. You know Chinese invented happiness? Inside a cookie. That's what we're doing here. We're putting <laughs> happiness inside a box. Just for $15. Look on the back. It's your lucky numbers. <laughs> That's 13, 12, 29. That's not a code. That's what you should play on the next Huh. So we have a deal here or what? I got to move on. Only got a limited copy. That's how, that's how codes work. We only got a limited supply on the internet. Is that how the internet that's works? That's how the internet works. That's I guess I, I'll sign. I'll sign. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, do you have any games you want to sell back to me? Anything? Maybe possibly that's a full price. Well, I can if give you this game is so good, good, I guess we could just give Jimmy's all of his games in and we'll get some store credits. And that's cash. right. Yes, What's you the... get some. You get a hot, cold bag of Game Informer. Here you go. All, the, all of them you could want. I, I, hmm. How am I supposed to use this? Done deal. Okay. Who's up next? You want Dreamcast? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's a nightmare. That God damn it, over. Holy oh, cow. That won't happen. Probably. All right, we're going to move on. Yes, we should. Uh, let's move on to some quickies here. Here's another uh, story, a little uh, Dear dear Beast cast. Uh, welcome, oh, boy, this one. Welcome this? to our uh, ethics, ex- ethics section here. Yeah. Uh, dear Beast cast, my friend recently received an Xbox One as a gift from his wife. That's a good gift. Mm <laughs> hmm. For some reason, he decided to create a new gamer tag rather than use his old one. Curious decision, but okay. A few days later, I received a friend request from an account called Turbo Danger Wank. <sighs> All one word. All one word. Intercapped. Intercap. Turbo Danger Wank. Now, I'm going to skip to the PS at the bottom of here because I did not, um, I did not uh, know what th- this meant. If you don't know what a danger wank is, apparently, apparently, yeah, right. Apparently, it's where you shout someone to come to you, like your mom, and then try to orgasm in time. That is not a danger wink. I'm not. I don't. It takes wanna, all kinds. I'm not Austin. trying to kink shame. I'm not trying to yuck anyone's yum. Yeah, don't yuck my yum. Wait, what? Don't I don't want to yuck anyone's yum. Don't yuck my yum. But don't. That's what. Because, like, what if you? There's a point at which, yeah. if you're not asked, there's a point at which the thing you were doing is not cool. Yeah. Because that other person's going to get there. Like, but, what if you fucked that up? Well, then you just like, oh, fuck, you know what? I you forgot, called I, me I, in I, here. I forgot why you'd come in here. I actually, can you go, can you go and see if I left the lights on in my car? I say this 
I, again, I say this in the same vein as, uh, you know, don't kink shame or whatever, but straight up, if your masturbation rituals are actually based around dangerous scenarios, yeah, you but... have lost control of your life. Straight up. There's, you are out of control. You need to see someone. You need to talk to someone about this because you, that should, that is not what should be, that's not how that's supposed to work. You know, it's supposed to be the opposite. The element of danger you know, is not supposed to be the thing. The, it is a very strange thing. I know it is, you but. Know the, you know the old saying, like, your right to swing your fist ends at my face? It's your... old. Your right to oh, swing your fist ends at my, ends fi- yeah. at my face. Yeah. I think your right to like danger wank ends yeah. at me. You catching s- it? Yeah, at you land- landing it on me. This is not a novice maneuver. This is like you're like fuck, man. I've I've been it. And this I've dude decided it. he wanted to just like broadcast that and be like, yo, I turbo, turbo. danger, I turbo danger wank. I I do danger wank on the fucking. You're on the other room, and I'm like, but you know, but when you're getting to this level with something like that, the difference between you and like the sort of person who dies in a flashback in a Hellraiser movie <laughs> is like razor fucking thin. Like you are a depraved pleasure seeker at that point. You are the narrator in Darkest Dungeon. Don't get you down. are bored with the carnal pleasures of yes. life. So you're awakening an ancient evil and summoning it to you and trying to orgasm before it gets there <laughs> yeah Cthulhu, I mean, Cthulhu, can you just uh can you just get some popcorn and bring you know how over? turbo fucking danger wink i am i fucking i initiate a fucking google chat and get oh it, god get, damn it get it done before we before it connects that's how fucking dane turbo i'm taking I am. you off my friends list <laughs> i will start is the, there more to this email i will start the skype well, call yes there is more to this email all right confused i sent him a text and he confirmed it was him now as we were both fathers i thought it was pretty immature and short-sighted of him to choose that name i agree turbo danger wing i reported him so he could get his one free name change a few months later, Microsoft changes it to something random and says he has to pay to change it. Turns out Microsoft has changed their terms of service, so you have to pay to deter people from abusing that policy. Now he's stuck with something pretty crap. I didn't want his daughter, my goddaughter, from and my kids playing Xbox with him in a few years' time and having to explain his gamer tag again, that gamer tag being Turbo Danger Wink, am I a bad friend or a bad person? Here's the thing. Uh, if you're the sort of person who would actually name yourself Turbo Danger Wank, you shouldn't be allowed to be around children anyway. Uh, are you a bad friend? No. Are you, are you the I best friend? I just figured friend? out a loophole here. Yeah? Well, I didn't see this yesterday, so I'm glad we returned to this. Yeah. This email starts, for some reason... He decided to create a new gamer tag rather than use his old one. Yeah. He still has an old gamer tag. He could just go back to it. He could it. just go back to it. Presumably. I, do, you, I, do you get a free like uh, change? change when you sign up? So you were supposed to, but uh, I don't know if you maybe. can. Because he's talking about here, you say change their service, so maybe not. But maybe you got the free... When like an Xbox One, you could you, change Yeah, maybe name. if you're like... There was a point there where you had to like... Maybe he got one from regular to gold and like... Uh, right. Uh, and was like, oh, okay, you can change this or like... You've been on 360. You got a new thingy. Sign up for yeah. Windows maybe 10. that's it. I think. I think if you feel bad about it, if it's if it's uh, first of all, does he know that you're the one? Right. Second of all, well, it does now. Second of all, uh, you can always give him the money. How much is it? Thirty bucks or something like that? Maybe you can pay. You can be like, ah, uh, you know, hey, I'm gonna give you the cash. Or you could just be like, that's a shitty fucking name. Yeah. I'm not. Someone must have. Someone must have uh, reported. No, you. own up to it. Be like, I can't. Okay. Do you want? Is it worth it to you? Is our friendship? To, it's our friendship, and and playing some hot fucking destiny worth it, or should you just change it? What's your bad name? What is it like? Seven seven nine seven seven. Is it right? Just keep that weird name. Keep that, the name they gave you. What if it's like slow wanker? What if they or like knock like, on like, his door? What if it's like just it's, <laughs> slow it's, wanker? Yeah, the, 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 the name is like boring ass masturbator, and it's like that's not me. That's not me. I'm a danger waker. I am the world's <laughs> most exciting masturbator. That's not me. Shit. You're just going to re-register it again as like XXX Turbo Danger Wanker for 2067. Yeah. Uh, I'd just like to declare at least a one-week moratorium on masturbation discussion after this. I feel like we've maybe plumbed the depths here for We're a little bit. It. Welcome to 2016. We've shot our load here. Yeah, I definitely think we've blown it here. Uh, okay. Let's let's maybe you know give it a little time to recharge before I, we go in again. No, a little, a little rest. I'm, I'm not ready to erect that policy. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, we gave him that one. We got to give him that one. Uh, boner. <laughs>